Hey guys, welcome to another episode of The Raps of Drinking the Stars. I'm your host, Greg Gilman, and today we decided to skip the bar and we're just having a little office party at the Rap Studios in Los Angeles with Finn Whit Whitrock Ooh. from American Horror Story Freak Show. Hey, what's cheers, up? dude. Cheers. Thanks for joining this me. Is, yeah, this is the best interview ever. So far. <laughs> so far. It could begun. go horribly yeah, awry. It's, it's, gone, it's this good. Listen, yeah. you, don't know who, yeah. you don't know who you're talking to. <laughs> Things could go downhill bad. Bring it on. Any moment. Bring it on. Tell me, what's it like playing a psychopath? I was. Um, given the gift of like a really outside the box character, you know, mm -hmm. something that you really don't get to do every day. And um, the writers really kind of like took a lot of big risks, you know, like like pushing this guy and like kind of pushing the envelope with what he could do and to kind of keep, like kept trying to outdo themselves like every, every new episode, you know, what can Danny get away with this time? So it's really fun to like, like kind of push that territory and still try and keep it somewhat grounded so it doesn't go into like the world of um, you know comic book psychopath mm -hmm. stuff. A lot of actors I talk to will tell me that they'll try to find a way for them as an actor to relate to the character. Mm -hmm. How did you know Finn relate to Dandy? Yeah well I mean it's hard you know it's like <laughs> <laughs> how do I relate to bathing in my mother's blood like how, how do I do that? Um, but again you gotta I, I kept trying to come back to like like, you know, if I, like, if, you know, we all talk about, like, our inner child, and we all think of that's, like, a very um, beautiful, innocent place, which a lot of it is, but it's also, you know, your inner child is also, like, pure ego, you know? It's pure, like, me, 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 and what can I get? And, like, you know, an infant, I remember reading something, like, an, an, if an infant had, like, strength and power, he would, like, like kill anyone to get to his mother's mm -hmm. breast, you know what I mean? You kind of find that that little that little demon inside you, and just like let him rip. You know? Yeah, American Horror Story has been nominated for I can't even tell you how many Emmys. I wasn't gonna count. I know a lot. They're like crazy. nominated since the beginning. For every season, they get a crazy amount of Emmy nominations. Um, is you know what do you think about this show that you think the Academy just loves? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no. um, well, I think that. Uh, uh, you know, it's still m maintained this amazing ability to like s keep itself a mini series. Mm -hmm. You know, um, so it it is kind of like unique because it's each season is is self-contained. You know, it's its own thing, like from beginning to end. But there's a uh, a cast that's being like recycled. So it's like a yeah, like a rep company in theater. You know, um, and also it just like just has like really good actors. You know, like. You know, you just have like l lots of really good talent in one place, in one room, kind of doing this um, very heightened, like no holds barred sort of storylines. You know, like it just takes like crazy risks, and I think that's what people dig. And 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 it doesn't, uh, yeah, it doesn't pull its punches. You know, it's mm -hmm. like it's 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 out there, and it's like yes, we're we're the show that's out there, and like yeah. we like go for it and like keep pushing the envelope. Um, and also, you know, it's a horror genre, but like, there's a lot of elements involved. You know, there's like, there is, there are love stories, and there are really, like, tragic stories, and there's like camp and comedy and musical. You know, it, like, it's kind of this uh, smorgasbord. You know, it's yeah, like it has the, a little bit of everything. Yeah, a little taste for everybody yeah. there. Runs the game. Unless you're afraid yeah. of clowns, then you're yeah, then you're <laughs> then screwed. you're out. Yeah, Sorry. not watching it. Yeah. Um, so, as an actor, is is, you know. Is award consideration something like, is that part of your goal? Is that part of your, the dream? Or is that just like, hey, if it happens, it happens? Um, a, a lot of this business is like about trying to like cancel out the noise and like focus on the real thing, you know? Yeah. So, you know, it's, it's, it's great, like it strokes your ego and it's, but you know, you have to kind of kind of keep coming back to like what is real, you know? Yeah. And, and what's getting you to those parties? Yeah, what's important? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, so. All right, guys, thank you so much for tuning in to another episode of The Raps Drink with the Stars. And thank you my guest, Finn Whitrock, for joining me here at The Rap Studios, a little day party. Uh, for more interviews like this, click the link below.